Hey guys, welcome back. It's me again, Joji, and in today's video, I will be talking about my top three concealers that I really trust. And last week, I did upload my top three foundations. If you guys are curious what are my top three foundation, I will put the link on the description down below. So let's go ahead with my number three concealer. This one is from NYX or NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop concealer. In my makeup wardrobe, I don't have a lot of drugstore brand. But this, I'm so glad that I got it and tried it and see how it goes and oh my goodness. If I want a daily concealer, this is what I always grab and I always reach for because it's just so good. This is what I'm wearing right now. I set it with a RCMA powder and it's just so good. It lasts me all day. I really, really love the coverage, uh, the way how it sits on under my eyes. It's not drying. It's just a perfect amount of creaminess. So I like it a lot and I do love the shades that comes with it. And this one is the shade Natural. So really, really good guys. And guess what? It is so inexpensive and that is why I use this as my daily concealer because it's so good. And now let's jump into my number two concealer and this one is from Pat McGrath Perfection Concealer and in shade LM9. Oh my goodness you guys, I so love this concealer. It's just because of the coverage. Uh, it is a bit more creamy so you really have to make sure that you set it with a powder especially if you have an oily skin. Really, really make sure that you have the good powder that you trust but really good one if you're looking for a coverage as well as if you have dry under eyes. This is probably gonna work for you because of the creaminess on it. Okay, are you guys ready for my number one concealer? If you have been on my channel, of course you know this as well but this is my number one concealer no surprise this is from nars uh, radiant creamy concealer really really love this concealer i feel like i could build up to a medium to full coverage but as well as natural if i want just like you know natural coverage of course and this one it's everything i have a lot of shades from this line because throughout the season i do tan quite a bit in the summer in the winter this is sort of my spring color now but in the winter i get a little bit more uh, pale but not so much but this concealer this is not a surprise it's everyone's og everybody's love this and that's why i love it too because it just really works and it's so good and it's not drying so that is my number one concealer you guys and i also have a um And I also have an honorable mention for you guys, of course, because I only choose my top three that I think I do use a lot and I trust. So that's why I have honorable mentions for you and this time I have three. So number one is this guy right here. This is from Clinique line smoothing concealer oh my goodness this is such a good concealer if you want a thin coverage but covers as well i don't see a lot of creasing on this one so i really think that this concealer is really good for just such a thin coverage but at the same time it doesn't increase so line smoothing concealer really good and then the other one is from Too Faced uh, Born This Way Concealer. This is such a good one too if you want more natural, especially if you have dry under eyes, really good. I find it that every time I apply this on my eyes, I just feel like under my eyes is sort of like a natural but more younger looking. I really, really like the finish of this one. And you know, with all the complexion, for example, foundation, concealer, not everything works for you. So you really have to experiment. And this is what I've been doing with all my makeup. And I'm just sharing my knowledge with you because I did try most of them already. And of course, my last honorable mention is the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. You are probably surprised why this one is not on my top three. It's just because the more I use it, I just really find it that it's drying under my eyes and I have moved on from that and I find something else that really works the best for me. I find the formula of this, it's sort of a drying kind of effect on my eyes and it, it almost tend to look like a little older so i do not want to use this every day and that is why it's my honorable mention but a lot of people love this concealer and if you're one of them i mean you know we all have different skin skin type we all have different experience with the makeup so it's really not about you why this is my honorable mention but this is about what works for me and i'm just sharing it with you guys so that is my honorable mention 
tart shape tape and i think that's everything for me today guys i showed you my top three concealer and my honorable mention i hope you find this video useful if you did please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit the notification bell so that you are updated whenever i upload my next video thank you guys for watching and i will see you on my next one bye guys